It's Friday. There's a place. This one now is certainly, I would say, is going to be the biggest yet. Uh, this is now our fourth jamboree. Uh, and each year they've been getting, or each event, they've been progressively getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Friday night, and our, obviously our headline been Mike Denver, who's been here a couple of times before and has always packed the place. Great atmosphere, great showman, and with the support of Jim Devine, who was the recent runner-up in the voice competition on RTE, you know, it's, it makes it up to be a, a brilliant night. Saturday night is going to be a massive night in country. Listen, it's probably going to be the biggest night in country this year. We've got the two top country singers at the minute on the same night. That night, we've got Derek Ryan and Nathan Carter and Johnny Brady along with Thomas Mulligan and Ben Curry. So listen, it's going to be an absolutely fabulous night. It's the, the whole arena is going to be really rocking that night. Sunday night, we've upped our ante again. We've got the popular all folked up. We've got the whistling donkeys, we've got the logues and the internationally famous High Kings. A fabulous band, you know, a band that really everybody can't miss. Other things people are going to expect to see is the courtyard where it used to be sort of sand and gravel outside the main arena. That's all been concreted. The toilet situation has been sorted. We have a big sort of specialised ladies section coming in and a gent section coming in. So there'll be big improvements there and plenty of toilets for everybody. Bar situation has been extended even further from the last time and it's been moved down to the bottom, thus then leaving a lot more room inside the arena for everybody to enjoy this year's jamboree. The bands love coming here. There's not many venues that can hold the sort of volume of people that we can hold and create that atmosphere. Like not only this time in the courtyard with it all being concreted, we've also got a bit of a fun fair going on out there as well with really good professional rides. So even if you're standing outside, you know, trying to sort of relax, there'll still be activity, there'll be big screens up outside, so you can still watch what's happening inside, outside. It's going to be a super night. But I think with the whole way the whole hall's been laid out this time, with the upstairs, with the, the change and sort of layout, we're bringing over different tables this time from England, importing them for the, this year's event. And everything's going to be changed inside, so really, you know, every little sort of little problem that we had the last time has been certainly ironed out for this time. Final word, don't miss this next jamboree, it's the biggest one yet, it's going to be a great weekend.